Hey, divas and gents, I am coming to you with my scrapbook expo in Ontario, California goodness. So I'm going to dive right on in. So I have a lot to show and I want to throw a quick shout out to my girls. I finally got to meet Armin, who is Happy Mail Queen. I got to meet Mimi, Mimi who is So Scrappy 79 and Sophia, who is Paper Sweets here on YouTube. I subscribe to all their channels. I watch all their videos. So it was really awesome to meet them in person. They also also had a friend with them who doesn't do videos and I forgot your name forgive me um, but please leave a comment so I can keep your name and if you have an Instagram or if you have a Facebook or something where you show your crafty goodness please let me know private message me or something so I can see and I'm really hoping that you'll do videos please just do videos it's awesome all of us crafters love to watch everybody and each other so I hope that the girls pressure you enough to do it so it was awesome to meet them I went with Tammy who is SS crafter one hey girl she was my ride or die for the day and then I got to meet saw uh, from saw crafters which was really cool and go to her booth I'm going to show you some of the goodness from her and is that all my shout outs okay that's my shout outs for now let's dive in all right let's start with saw crafter her prices are really good um i i mean it's really good price so i paid 4.99 um for these and believe me i wanted to do more and but i already went outside my budget and i totally swore i would not do it dang it all and I didn't bring anything with me but my bank card. Mind you, I kept all the, the plastic. I kept at home, but it didn't stop me. Because what did Anna do? Transferred money. See? See what I'm saying? Issues. So these right here, you know, you paint it. You paint these ones. Layer them on top. Put a picture in here. Design it. Hey, make ornaments. Whatever. I love the smell of the wood. I don't know what it is about them, but they smell great. So it was a pack of these. And it's a set of one, two, three, four, five. You get five sets of these. So it was pretty much like a dollar each for a set. So it was a really good deal. The quality is great. I mean, there's smooth surface right here. It's not like any raw wood because they put like a finishing on it, I think. Oh my gosh. She has so many cool things. So many cool things. And I really wanted to dive in and go crazy, but I couldn't. And these ones right here were $1.59. I just got the hangers because I'm going to create little banners. And I don't want to take them out of the packaging. So I got those. And then I got these right here because I saw that Marissa got these. So, duh, I had to get them. And these right here are the little coffee cups and coffee mugs. Look at that with the burnt look. I actually like it like this. I mean, I actually like it just in the raw form. It's gorgeous. And then, of course, I had to get these super cute glasses. And, oh, yeah, these were $1.69. And then these ones were $1.59. And the different um, style glasses. Super, super cool. So that's all I got from Saw. And um, then I went, Tammy and I went to, what does it say? Let's focus. Craftfantastic.com. I go to their booth every year, <laughs> every year, because they always have a free little make and take. So I did one little tiny one, of course, I had to get a yellow rose and it's just, it's glass. And you just, of course you get to pick the image and adhere it. They always have a free one. So I went ahead and I got these heart bezels and bronze. And then I got the heart glass pieces. These are glass that are not acrylic. Well, there's two per bag. They put two in a bag, but there's 10 in each. So these right here to go inside, I want to make some, um, these right here, these little keychain thingies. I want to make these with my um, granddaughter and, um, give them as gifts. So I want to put for photos. So there's 10 in this bag. It was $8.95. And then it's $3.95 for the glass cabajons. And then this one right here, there's only five sets in this one, $4.95. But I could always get more of these from like Michael's or Joann's or whatever. So these three I picked up from craftfantastic.com. Okay. And then I went to, I found the Graphic 45, or Graphic 45, Greeting Farm um, booth. 
and I was really looking for the unicorns and the miniature ones that just came out but of course they sold out so I didn't get them bummer but I did get these so stinking cute and then I finally got to pick up this one this was one of the ones I wanted love it oh my gosh they have like the best image of unicorns super cute and that's all I got from grading farm and then oh the lady that was there at craft fantastic she um gifted tammy and i some of these images they normally charge for these so it fits all the sizes that they sell and um so that was really cool and nice of her they're really cool images and um but you know what i'm saying you don't need these to use those but it was nice of her to gift us those and then um oh then we went to this place right here. It's called the Cat's Meow. And this is their um, information. The Cat's Meow dot biz. Okay. So here is their information. They were really, really cool. Tammy and I got to sit with Evelyn. And she got to show us how to use our watercolor pencils. And just sat and took time with us. We went at the end of the show and everything. So everybody was already leaving. So it was really cool. I got to color this image with watercolor. And I don't know if you're going to be able to see that it focus. It's not going to show. But you can see right here. I used glitter pen. They sell glitter pens. I'm going to show you this because I bought them. And then this is on Prima watercolor. And Janelle had gifted me some of this. So I'm going to stamp some of these images that I have. And I'm going to use my watercolor. I really like how that came out. And I finally found a good brush, which are the Prima ones. The one I had, water came out too much. So this right here, it was only $6.95. And I got to test these out before I bought them, so I liked it. Everything stayed in the lines, and she showed us how to use. Because I have the Prima Color pencils, but I only have two of the sets. I need to collect the rest of them. And I love it because you don't see the strokes. And she showed us some cool tricks on how to do, like, hey, you see the highlighting here and there. By just getting the pencil, like, once you lay the pencil down, you don't wet the paper first. You get the pencil, and you just, like, color along the, like, on the sides. And then you use the watercolor to brush it out. And if you need to darken that, don't take the pencil and color over it because it messes up the paper. So you just get the water brush and the pencil, and you get the water brush, and you color you take the pencil and you just color off the tip of the pencil and then you take that and then you put that back down on the image and then you can darken the spots you want it so your shading can begin i didn't know that and i really loved it so i got to do a little bit of the shading on the boots this was just a tester run for me so i was really excited and happy that i learned how to do that and then i got these right here it was $14.95 and it was a really great price for these and I love that they're in these containers. So right here are all the milky pastels. So you get 12 milky pastels and you get 12 glitter pens and these glitter pens are fine tip. So they get in all the little tiny things really well and Tammy and I got to test them out and she was sold herself and had got some of these as well. I absolutely loved them. It was a great price. Even if you wanted to just get, let's say just the glitters, they were $8 for the set. Or if you just wanted these, it was $8. So it was a really great deal for these and I don't use Copics. So it's either color pencils, watercolor or glitter pens. That's what I use for coloring. So I was really excited to get this and that it's in a grid case and it was really inexpensive. Because you don't even get $15. You get six pens at Hobby Lobby. Nowhere near will you get this many glitter pens. So anywho. And then they gifted us um, Prima Bling. Just for shopping. So that was really sweet. They were. I loved the lady. She was really nice. And so if you see any of these. Um, if you want to take a look at this. They do sell them on their website. So that's that. Okay. And that's the cat's meow. Oh, and then I stopped, we stopped at Sherry Baldy. And I had to get coloring books because these are Christmas gifts for my sisters. So I got the small one, which is a $7 one. This one is um, um, Copic 
paper. So for those of you that want to use Copics, you would get the $7 one. The $10 big ones are not um, Copic friendly. Um, I um, I don't know if you can. I think, yeah, these ones are the ones that are not. These ones are. So I didn't get, I don't Copic, but I liked these images because these are like five by sevens that I can um, color with my pencils. I can color watercolor and I could cut them out and put them in a frame. So that would be really cute. And uh, all the images are different. And this is the fairy one I got. The Wee Winged Magical Fairies. I love fairies. They're always so stinking cute. And especially by um, Sherry. She Her designs are amazing. I cannot believe she just does this. This is all her hand. Just by hand. Just amazing. Gorgeous. So I'm just flipping through it really quick so you guys can kind of get an idea of the images because you only get one of each. And then, so this one is for me. And then look at this. She hand signs every one of them. She does not photocopy her signature and then put it in every page. She took the time to hand do each single book that you buy from her. I thought that was really classy of her to do, and I just loved it. I thought that was really nice, and she's a very, very sweet lady, and she lives out in my area, so I absolutely love it because she's going to be hosting. She has a barn that she's created that she's doing so that she can host classes and stuff there, and I'm so all about it. All about it. And then I got this coloring book right here, which is the, it's the one Pat and Bestie Bird Ladies. So this one right here has birds and cats. My sister is a cat lover. So she's going to love this book because she doesn't like the other coloring books that are like a, just a bunch of geometric shapes and stuff like that. So she's going to dig this. So I got this one for her. And she uses crayons and coloring pencils and glitter pens. I got this for my other sister who is a big fan of fairies. So this one right here is going to be for her as well. So I picked those up for Christmas for them. Then I stopped at Marissa who is Creative Young Mama. She designs, guest designs for um, Go Washi. They had a booth and Marissa showed these um, on her channel that she got these. So yep, I was all about it. So I picked these two up for my friend Tara. Hey girl, who is Nurse Tara here on YouTube. And then I grabbed these two for myself. So these are super cute. They were $5 each. All right. So that's those. Oh, and I also got these from Sherry Baldi as well. These are already pre-cut, pre-colored. And there's, I think, three or four of these images. And you're supposed to layer them to give it that 3D effect. So I'm going to try this out. Super duper cute. And then we stopped at to do a make and take at um, Fun Stamper's Journey, which is owned by Richard Garay. He was there with his wife and um they'd host they always host a big class like they take up a good section of the convention or wherever they go and they give free classes free make and takes which is really awesome they don't charge and he always gives free stamps which is really cool because these are good quality stamps the last one tammy and i did he gave us like a full sheet of stamps and it's so sweet and thoughtful of him to do that because you know i mean this cost this ain't cheap so it was really cool that we did we didn't have time they were already shutting down and stuff so they just allowed us to do some stamping and then tammy and i'll just put these together later okay and then tammy was ever so sweet and brought me gifts so she has a dollar king because she lives out in the la area um i don't i'm in the inland empire so she went ahead and picked up some of these rosettes for me which i love because then i don't have to make them and if i don't like the buttons in the middle i'll pop them out and then i'll lay down and do the layering that i want to do on the rosette as long as the rosette is done the work is done or if i wanted to add this on top of this pop those buttons off i mean it, the, i love it it's so stinking cool i love that she got these thank you so much girl so these right here are super adorable they're dimensional i love them so these are from my friend and also too at um sherry baldy's booth i didn't even see this this right here is um colorless let's see if i can get it to focus. 
colorless colored pencil blender. So instead of using mineral spirits, odorless mineral spirits, this right here is supposed to be the same type of effect, um, but you don't have to worry about it spilling or whatever. I'm going to try this out. They, um, she did say you can dip your pencil directly in here to help blend to take away the strokes of um, your colored pencils which we would use um, you know the mineral spirits for or you can use your stub I use stubs so I'm gonna try it out I've never tried it out I'm gonna try it with both and then I'll go ahead and I'll show a preview of how this works and maybe I'll do a comparison and with the mineral spirits and see which is different if you notice a difference or how that looks but I liked it because it was compact size so I could just throw this in my to-go kit instead of carrying a bottle of the mineral spirits with me so I'm, I'm hoping this works out really well um, Tammy and I also did a make and take is this not gorgeous it's fabric and it, this was at the Mona Ami um, spot and they have this adhesive here that's crazy sticky tacky and um, so, uh, and they, you just use the fabric and you're just gathering the fabric in a big circle and it's a yard. This is one yard of fabric. And then sh she gave us a bling that we could stick in the middle and it's just adhered with the same tacky stuff. So uh, once this gets removed, we have to put felt. So you're going to cut a piece of felt and put it on that. And then, you know, because it's going to be tacky. As soon as you take this off, it's going to be sticky. So I thought that was gorgeous. It was a $3 make and take but it was so pretty so we did that okay and then we did okay that's just at the bottom we did a mad rush at the end we're sitting there thinking that we're gonna leave and um they had a bunch of sellout stuff wholesale sellout stuff at the end you walk out of the the convention and they had boxes of this stuff and you had to wait until five o'clock and the women mad rushed mad rushed to get these things okay so this right here was for three dollars it's an atc size um die cut or die set so this cuts out the whole shape and then you, of course you cut this out and this cuts another layer or you can leave it in and it'll just cut out the border of it so it's three bucks score okay and then um we got this kit set it's a dear lizzie kit set and it came with six papers and some wooden embellishments and then some stickers, some puffy stickers. So super cute. Um, I don't know which line this is on Dear Lizzie, but I think I don't even think you get six. I think you only get four sheets of this. And I'm not going to take them out only because I only have so much time. And then this was another kit. This one right here. Oh, this is on trend too. This one right here was only five dollars, and you get this whole little note card size of a bunch of different of the pieces from the set. A 12 by 12 chipboard set of um, from that, and then you also get I think four or six sheets of the on trend papers that go with it for the on trend too. And the one that I showed you before that, the Dear Lizzie, was four dollars. And then they have, for three dollars you get this right here, which was the Julie Netting. This is what her new line, which I'm really glad because I picked up a few single sheets of this. So it's a six by six and the sticker sheet, and yeah, just the sticker sheet. So it's the sticker sheet plus the six by for three dollars. This right here costs six dollars normally. So that was a score. And let me tell you, I had to mad rush for those because they only had so many of them, and these ladies were like freaking vultures. <laughs> And then we've got Graphic 45 that Sophia had picked up. Each one of us were in different stations and we just picked up a bunch for each other. So we didn't miss out. <laughs> so thank you, girl. So this right here are some of the die cuts from the Graphic 45. This one right here in this Thamon Amor collection. And these are die cuts. Yeah. And there right here are going to be some die cut punch outs. And then these ones right here you have to cut out yourself so i thought that was a great deal this was only four dollars for this set okay and then was that all i got yeah that's all i got from then and then i stopped here which is scrapbook grammy there's her information scrapbook grammy julie at gmail.com okay stopped at her booth and i picked up this julie nutting i wanted this one so bad um 
I can't even show it. It's taped all the way around. Ugh. So anyways, this is the new Julie Netting um, paper, 6x6. Six six. It's so cute. It's paper dolls. Super cute. Super glad that I got that. I also picked up some of these so that I can get my own fabric, my lace, and I can do those flowers myself. These are just the goobers, or the gloobers. So you could get these, which they have, because this is Cosmo Cricut, and you can do your own fabric so you don't have to do the sewing. So for those of us that are like, I don't feel like doing that, you just get the fabric and you just keep doing it in a big circle. And then it's already tacky and it's ready to go. This is old school, and I just, I got pumped off of doing that one, so whatever and then this is the julie netting paper the ones that i picked up individual sheets and this is from her bell is it bell v bella v totally probably killing the name right now and this is both sides of that one and this is the one that i got the six by six from it's the same paper line and then this one right here is the paper dolls and then it's this um, print on this side. It's gorgeous. Sorry for my dog. She's barking. I have to bring her in. And then I have this right here. I used to pay, play with these when I was little. Oh my gosh. I love it. And this is just a gray um, color. And then this one right here has um, actually all the dolls. I was really excited about getting this one because I love it. And then it's just this right here. Like a Robin's egg blue with red stars. So I got that and I also got this one right here, which is the sticker sheet. And this sticker sheet is the paper dolls. So I'm super glad that I ended up picking these up. Love them. Love, love, love these stickers. They're so stinking cute. I love her stuff. I love it. It totally takes me back to my childhood. Okay, and then I had to stop that off antique. I, I swear, he already recognizes me. Is that bad? He's the owner. <laughs> he recognized me because I, I go to his stop every time I go, and I go to two expos a year. I go to the one in Ontario and California, and then I also go to the Anaheim one. And he always goes, and I always go there, and I buy it. This is one of my favorite paper lines is Authentique because the quality is insane. So I picked up this one right here, which is, gosh, I have like three minutes, called Wishes Collection absolutely let me see okay it's so pretty let's see if i can do it without the glare sorry guys so i have and it comes like that super cute it's all about birthday absolutely love it with the cupcakes so super cute so this one right here comes with six double-sided papers it comes with cut aparts stickers and mini alphas so these are the cut aparts super and he always has great deals he is so amazingly generous with the prices he charges on his papers this right here was a must-have absolutely i believe i have the six by six when i purchased this from nat store but i had to have the 12 by 12 and oh my gosh this one right here because it's yellow yeah you know i'm all about it but look at that with the blue. Are you dying? It's nuts. It's just absolutely insanely gorgeous. And it's super thick. And you can take a bone folder to this bad boy and it doesn't crack. Look at that. I love, love their paper. Just gorgeous. So it was a super great deal, let me tell you. Um, I believe, I don't know if it was 5 or $10. I don't remember. But his prices on his stuff is amazingly good. Like, he does not try to jack you by any means. And that's it. I did it! And I have one minute to spare. <laughs> so thank you guys so much for stopping by and enjoying my haul before I can start putting stuff away. And I got a lot of crafting to do tomorrow. And thank you guys so much for hanging around. My new subbies, you guys are amazing. And my old school subbies, you guys are the bomb. So thank you guys so much for stopping by. And I will be back very soon. Don't you worry.